Recently approved by the FDA, there is a new treatment for acne and anti-aging. It's called the Illumask. It's a low-level laser treatment that's done at home. What it consists of is two different masks. There are masks that you wear at home for 15 minutes. The anti-aging mask has red LEDs of a particular wavelength, 440 nanometers, and infrared wavelength LEDs of 830 nanometers. What it does, you wear it for 15 minutes every night, and then you do it over and over again. What it does, it stimulates collagen, it increases the elastin content in your skin, it evens out the tone, tightens the pores, basically rejuvenates the skin. Now the beauty of this is that it's a very simple treatment that, that, that is done at home. And the mask lasts for a month and then you replenish it with a new mask. The second mask is an anti-acne mask. Now both of these masks underwent rigorous trials and clinical trials, FDA approval. Uh, the anti-acne anti mask has a different array of LEDs. One is blue LED light of 440 nanometers, so again, it's a different wavelength, and red LED light of 660 nanometers. Again, arranged in a mask that you wear for 15 minutes every night. The interesting part is that blue light has been proven scientifically to kill bacteria that cause acne. Also, in the clinical trials that I ran, we found that there was a 100% decrease in the inflammatory acne lesions in the 30 patients that we evaluated and a 73% decrease in standard acne lesions, which is rather impressive. The fascinating thing about the anti-acne mask, which has blue and red light, is that not only does it affect the standard acne and the inflammatory acne, but what we saw in the clinical trials is that it also affects blackheads and cystic acne. Now we don't have, there is no FDA claim for cystic acne, but in the clinical trial we saw a significant reduction of that. And another factor that's fascinating about this combination of blue and red light, that it's not just additive, it's synergistic. So what happens is that the blue light by killing bacteria, red light also kills bacteria to a lesser degree, but it's very anti-inflammatory. So as I mentioned before, a 100% reduction in the inflammatory lesions by using that mask. The mask is used by patients at home. It has essentially brought LED therapy from our offices to patients' homes. But the way that we are using it in our practices is that it potentiates what I do surgically. For instance, when I laser resurface a whole face, whether it's an erbium or a CO2 laser, we give those masks, the anti-aging masks, for its anti-inflammatory properties to patients immediately after the laser resurfacing. They heal quicker, there's, there's less redness, less inflammation. Also, when I do a facelift, we use those uh, masks, again, the anti-inflammatory masks, to reduce the redness, reduce the swelling, and really speed up the healing process. So what we are doing is essentially every patient in a practice such as mine is given a mask, whether it's the blue and red LED mask or the red and infrared LED mask to speed up the recovery process.